Hey, I'm Andrew Connell. This video is an overview of one of the chapters in my course, Mastering the SharePoint Framework, that's available for uh, purchase on my site, Voitanos.io. This overview video is going to give you an idea of everything that the chapter uh, covers. You can learn more by checking out the description uh, in the notes below the video. Um, if you got any questions about this chapter or about the course in general, just make sure you drop a comment uh, below in, in the uh, below the video and I'll be sure to get back to you. So with that, let me get out of the way. Enjoy the overview to this chapter. Once you build and test a SharePoint framework project, the next thing that you'll naturally want to do is deploy it to production. I mean, you didn't build this thing just for fun to play around. We've got work to do. In this chapter, we will cover what is involved in the deployment from what files get deployed to SharePoint and what files are kept external to SharePoint. You will learn the intricacies of packaging processes and the deployment options that you have for deploying your project assets. Included in this chapter are demos for not only configuring, but also managing and deploying files to different deployment options like Office 365 CDN and Azure CDN, and even using other public clouds like Amazon Web Services to host your assets. So let's get going. 